My husband was a geologist. He started out with a big interest in geology when he was just a kid. He looked up and saw the moon and he said, man's going to go to the moon someday and I want to be the one to go. Why is man going into space? What's the purpose of his going into space and to focus on what he's going to do when he gets there? Soon after I had gotten back from Australia, I had a call from Carolyn Porco, who was one of Jean's students at Caltech. She checked with me and said, would you like Jean's ashes to go to the moon? They can put a capsule on the mission and he can go up to the moon with Lunar Prospector. And I said, oh yes, that would be great because Gene had always thought it would be great to go to the moon, and here was his chance. <laughs> Three, two, one, zero. The lunar Prospector flew to the moon with Gene's ashes on them. It crashed into the south pole of the moon, and Gene's ashes were with it. And now uh, Gene is on the moon. And when I look up there at the moon, I say, hi, Gene. Are you having a good time running around? Yeah. <laughs> Jean is the only person on the moon, <laughs> the only person with ashes on the moon. <laughs>